Welcome back you beautiful people of the internet and yes this is a second upload and the reason why I'm doing this video is kind of a uh, a video which is going to prepare you guys for this week ahead for Ark Survival Ascended. There is a major patch coming this week which you guys should all keep an eye out for because uh, it's going to be uh, it's going to be a pretty big one to fix a lot of aberration stuff. Also, right now, there is some connection issues with the EU servers, so I thought I would just keep you guys up to date with that. Also, some stuff on the extinction in this video, so hopefully I can go through all of this information and make it as clear as possible for you all. If you do enjoy today's video, make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you're new around here, and let's dive into your ARC news. So, as you can see, Savala has posted out today saying, Hey folks, we're aware of some connection issues with the EU servers. The problem should be fixed, but we're keeping an eye on to make sure everything stays stable. So if you're having any issues whatsoever, make sure, um, uh, you know, just uh, don't blame yourself because <laughs> um, obviously it's probably an issue over um, with. I don't even know what's going on, but hopefully it's been sorted now. Um, anyone playing on my servers, if you guys don't know, um, we have a Discord of about 1,400 people in right now, um, and we have currently five ARC servers, which are all aberration. There is three PvP servers and two PvE servers. Mods are yet to be there yet, but they will be coming over time, and also there are five more servers that will be coming. I know many of you have been waiting for it and calling for it, but there'll be 10 in total um, so yeah, if you want to come and join, um, I need to make sure I keep updating the Discord link in because I know sometimes people have troubles with it, but hopefully all should be good. So let's dive into the launch post-launch live updates of what you're expecting this week. Pretty big. Um, this came in the crunch. Um, so they said this week the live ops team is focusing on addressing various crash issues and they've made solid progress in resolving many of them. We'll continue to uh, be working on the remaining cases, including ongoing efforts to fix some straggler console crashes. And we also have re resolved an impactful rendering issue on PlayStation, which was due to the ground, which has now been fixed. I'm sure you PlayStation players have been enjoying that. With these crashes and rendering issues being addressed, we'll shift our attention toward a number of level fixes and general content and gameplay bugs in the coming weeks. To highlight a couple of the fixes in progress, the rock gliding, rock drake gliding, and the ascension issues, a Steam uh, version was deployed today, um, and this is now, by the way, fixed on console too for the rock drake gliding, um, and it's now live for all players. We're also prioritizing a fix for the ascension issue, which is expected to go uh, out with a planned major version. It says next week because that was in the crunch on Friday, but it will be this week. And of course, this isn't exhaustive. The pipeline is... is chock full of fixes that will be ready to go live so expect guys a major patch don't know the day it's happening yet but as soon as you see a video from me that says the major update is live you will know and i will go through the full patch notes with you and they also said additionally we're collaborating with our engineering partners and amd to resolve a crash occurring on newer drivers amd has reproduced the crash and is making good progress on a solution in the meantime, some players have reported success in eliminating the GPU crash on Aberration by rolling back their drivers to the following patch, which for me personally, um, you know, if I, I would probably wait um, for the update um, for this. I mean, it's up to you. I know a lot of people have rolled back their drivers already. Uh, if you want to do that, apparently that has caused a fix, but ho um, hopefully um, this will get sorted within the new patch as well. Um, here we go. Catapults. Please tell me catapults are fixed. And Savala has just forgotten to post it. And Dolly mentioned that it is very soon. <laughs> um, you know, that is the classic Studio Wildcard. They love the word soon. Um, they love using it. But yeah, this is in the uh, in the works right now because I know I've seen it in my Discord too. So many people saying catapults, please fix them. Um, but apparently it's coming. And I'm hoping this is going to be as part of the new patch. Now, this was interesting. Um, so pretty much what's been going on recently is Dolly has been talking about in the Discord that Extinction is being worked on by the team. And Dolly said she's working on the design sync and the environment of Extinction. Um, Dolly said, um, oh yeah, I'm part of the design team as one of my hats I wear at Wildcard. But I was just re referencing what we were up to. No Extinction in this crunch to be clear, just in case. Um, so obviously extinction we all want to see when it's coming we've got aberration to enjoy right now i know there's some problems with it but aberration's great as i said it's my favorite map so i'm having all types of fun on it um i was for me this was the map i was waiting for the most really i i am always so hyped for a new one but i'm very very pleased that aberration is now here 
Um, but Extinction will be coming, but I reckon it'll be in a couple of crunches time, to be honest. I still think we've got some time on that um, while Wildcard work on fixing some of the major aberration issues. Now, server rates have been reset back to the times one on uh, official servers and uh, small tribes and Artpocalypse have all been updated back to normal. But you guys know, um, I think, is this the last day now? I, I can't remember, but from the law i think this is the last time we're going to get them because they told us for two weeks after the aberration launch we were going to be getting times two every weekend so i don't know whether that's now over so i think it has been two weeks right um so you might not see another times two um until so what have we got coming up i mean you get the odd one here and there don't you uh, every now and then but you probably won't get another big one until fear evolved um which will, will be coming next month so that's something to look forward to um and yeah i think that's pretty much everything here's the full patch notes for everyone that wants to know they fixed an issue with the rock drake gliding on servers fixed a lighting flicker on aberration fixed an unintentional bug with the cosmo that allowed players to fly fixed an exploit fixed several crashes and yeah lots and lots of crashes have just been fixed over time and as we mentioned over in the PlayStation patch notes, um, they fixed an issue causing rendering issues on the ground after riding or dismounting a dino or vehicle. So yeah, Arx in a pretty is getting into a better place. We've got some really cool things to look forward to for the rest of the year. We obviously saw in the video I did earlier today that the Astrios official free version um, Greek um, map is going to be coming to the game. Um, in on October 10th, um, you're you're not going to be forced into buying the paid version. There are the, the difference. I, I explained in my video earlier today the differences between the free version and the paid version is pretty much just that there's certain more landscape you can explore and more bosses and stuff on the paid version. I myself will grab it myself. I'm also um, will do a gameplay video on it so you guys can like work out whether you want to buy it or not um so yeah that'll be pretty cool i'm looking forward to doing that um and for the rest of the year guys like i've mentioned we've got a lot coming up i was talking to a few friends um on um a few arc friends uh this week and just talking about you know we actually have quite a lot coming up for the game you know so rest of this month is going to be sorting out aberration issues which is what we all need um in october we will have fear evolved one and the free version launch of um astrius which looks like a fantastic map um then later on in october as i told you guys it's planned as we know right now for extinction to come out i highly doubt it i wouldn't look forward to extinction in october right now unless we're told guaranteed from wildcard in a community crunch that it's still coming the ETA is still October from Dolly, but that hasn't been updated in a while. So I would say we'll just wait. November, we've got the extra live stream. Um, just to let you guys know, I will be streaming the full 24 hours extra live stream. Um, so if you guys want to come and join me, I would really, really appreciate it um, because I would love to raise more money this year. Um, I think it was last, not so last year, I was quite busy um, and I was so upset because I only managed to stream for a little while. Um, and But we still managed to raise about $500, which was amazing. The year before we managed to raise, I think it was $2,000 in the end, which was incredible. Um, so I will be doing the full 24 hours this year. If you guys want to come and join along, raise some money alongside this at the Extra Life. This will be at the start of November, by the way, where they're also planning an Ark Survival Ascended surprise reveal. My literal guarantee, <laughs> no, I'm not going to give it, put a guarantee in there, but um, from what we've been seeing, the information that's coming out, I do think at the Extra Life event, they will announce the next paid DLC, which is coming, um, which is going to be like a part of the story after Genesis Part 2 really looking forward to seeing that that's kind of what we're expecting i doubt it's going to be arc 2 guys if i'm honest with you we've, we've been told we're going to get arc 2 information this year but i think it will just if it's anything i think it will be a delay um and then obviously in december we're, we're, we're still apparently this year we're still going to be getting potentially ragnarok and extinction valgero i'm sure will be delayed to 2025 um, but there's been no word on Ragnarok at the moment. So I'm sure Studio Wildcard will put out a information video on whether we're going to be getting both Ragnarok and Extinction this year or whether it's just going to be Extinction. So yeah, much love to you guys. Looking forward to a very exciting rest of 2024. 
really really just today i've been feeling inspired i've been feeling happy and i just want to say thank you guys so much for the support recently on the channel um and um you know without you guys i wouldn't be here and it really does mean the world to me so some points you get that with youtube you go through your ups and downs being a youtube creator um but sometimes that you know you I, I read a post from rampy who was actually another um he's another arc youtuber and he said you know you've got to really enjoy the highs while you're there and um and you know we go through a lot of lows in the art community we do and then that's something that happens but recently it's been a lot of fun and i really appreciate it seriously um so yeah looking forward to uh to, to grinding hard for you guys so much love i'll catch you in my next video and thank you for watching